Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be reviewing the Uggs Classic Slippers number two. This shoe I've been seeing so much lately, especially around the mall. I've been seeing teenagers, women, all just wearing these slippers, just strolling around, shopping, or even in the supermarket. The first time I saw them, I wasn't really into it, but since I've been seeing so many people wearing them, I've been liking them even more. I did get a pair. These are the ones I got, of course, in the neutral color, which is my all-time favorite. I mean, come on, it's a classic. The shoe is really great because you can wear this out if you choose to, but you can also wear it as a house slipper. I love house slippers that has a little bit of platform because it just makes your steps a little bit more comfortable. I really love that the fur and the suede are matching. I think that just makes it a little bit more chic. It doesn't stand out too much like it's a house slipper. I really like that detail. In terms of comfortability, I can see why people have been wearing these so much especially just to stroll around. They are super comfortable. It has the fur lining all the way on the inside and of course over here on the trim. Platform is really nice, gives you a nice bounce to your step. It also has a very small discreet Ugg stamp on the side. The obvious difference is that the Tasman shoe does have a backing in the back to hold your foot in so it doesn't slip out. In terms of sizing, I'm a true six and a half. I wear a size six in the classic Uggs booties. I also wear a size six for the Uggs Tasman shoe. This one is also size Size six, and this one gives me a quarter inch more room at the end, which is really great because I do have narrow feet and these do fit a bit wider. Therefore, when you are walking, your foot will slip out a little bit, whereas the slipper does not have one. Therefore, I think that's why this one is a little bit longer in length. Having that extra quarter inch makes a big difference because then your foot just won't slip off of the slipper. I wouldn't have to worry about getting the heels of my foot dirty. The platform between the two is exactly the same. In terms of the fabric, both shoes have the exterior suede material. The only difference is the inner lining where the Tasman shoe has the original sterling that you'll see in your classic booties and the other shorter booties whereas the slipper has this really soft fur which is super comfortable and very fitting for a slipper even if you want to wear at home. In terms of wearability between the two shoes, both shoes are really great. If you're the type of person who is always on the go, if you want to grab mail or if you are dropping the kids off the bus, going to the grocery stores or just taking a casual walk, both shoes are really great with casual outfits. I would say that the Tasman shoe has probably more of the upper hand. I would wear the Tasman shoe if I wanted to go to a casual brunch or if I wanted to dress up a little bit more. That's just because the Ugg slippers has the fur, which makes it more of a loungy sort of shoe, say like if you're wearing sweats or something like that. If you're torn between the two and you only had to pick one, honestly, it really depends on your lifestyle. Let me put it this way. If you're the type that is always on the go, 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 and you're always in loungewear, I would probably lean towards this. If you're interested in what I would pick for myself, I would go for the Tasman shoe. I would stick with the Tasman only because I do like to dress up a little bit more most days. I also don't have room for a lot of shoes. Of course, if I did, then I would have both. I would style this with sweats and also any sort of casual pants such as cargo pants, denim. I think those are all really great choices for this. I hope you all enjoyed this review and found it very helpful. If you did, please hit the like button and leave me a comment. It really helped me out with my channel. If you enjoy this type of content, please consider subscribing to my channel and I will see you in the next one. Thanks guys. Have a good day. Bye.